Good day everyone. So for today's video, we're going to build Twitter API. So first we need to log into your no-code API. So I'm already logged in. So what we need to do now is we're going to the marketplace. Okay. And then of course, search for the Twitter. Now it's right here. Just click this button, use this API. And then now we're going to create uh, the Twitter API. So just click this button. And now it will ask us for a name to this API. So just name whatever you want. Let's say my Twitter. And then now it will ask us for the API key. So for us to get that one, we need to go to developer.twitter.com. The link is right here down below. Just click this one. And it will lead us to the dashboard. So for some of you that still don't have the dashboard, uh, when you click the link, it will direct you to a page where you can create your dashboard. So as for me, I already created the dashboard. So I will show you how to get the tokens. So what you need to do is uh, just go to your projects app. So we have here, uh, for example, uh, yes, the Mosh app right here, which I already created. So uh, you just click here, the keys and tokens. So if you still don't have the dashboard, it will automatically generate the API key for you. So if you want to view it right again, it will show you right here the API key and the secret key. Okay, so let us regenerate the code. And it will show us right here the API key and the API key secret key. Okay, so what we need to do is just copy this codes and then paste it right here. Okay, so that's the API key. Just make sure, uh, don't get confused between the two, okay? Okay now, so it is asking now for the access token and access token secret. So this is, this two are different from this two. So let's go back to the developers, okay. And then here is the access token secret. So let's regenerate the codes and you will see it right here. Okay. So again, just copy and paste the access token key and the access token secret. Okay. So now uh, the only thing that we have left is the bearer token. So again, just Let's go back to the Twitter developers and then go to your bearer token. So just let's regenerate the code right here. Yes, regenerate. And then it will show you the bearer token. Okay, so just copy this one and then paste it right here on the bearer token. So we already filled up the information right here. Just click create. And then now API created successfully for this one. So you can try it out, use this API. And then it will show you, of course, the codes for the tweets that you have right here. Also, you can make a tweet right here. Tweet lookup and all the codes right here that you want to look at. So feel free to try it out for yourselves. And I hope you learn from this video. Thank you so much for watching and have a nice day.